Whatever happens around us goes right into our subconscious mind, which is also known as our emotional mind. That's why it's important to watch what we feed ourselves. And I'm not talking about physical food. I'm talking about life food, the things that we watch, the things that we listen to, the people we surround ourselves with. So if you, in your conscious mind, means being awake and in the present mind, if in that time you surround yourself constantly with negative music, uh, evil TV shows that are filled with bad vibes and evil spirits, that is what is going to rub off on your subconscious mind. So that's what's good to remember is that your subconscious mind is also your emotional mind. And when you are in your emotional state, that is what connects you to your emotions. So it's going to have a play in how you feel um, about what you're watching, about what you're listening to what you're absorbing, what you're taking in. For example, I used to watch this TV show when I was younger called Unsolved Mysteries. And just listening to the guy's voice alone had me feeling scared. Um, besides the stories that he was reporting on, you know. So we have to think about when we watch when we're watching and when we're listening to things how does it make us feel um because sometimes people aren't really highly emotional um uh, so it, whatever they look at or you know things like that it may not stay on their mind for a long period of time um some people it may stay on their mind for a day two days a week they may dream about it so it's a good idea to ask yourself, am I feeding myself food that is helping me? Or does it make me feel good? Does it improve the way that I feel? Or is it making me feel negatively? Is it moving me towards greatness? Or is it keeping me mentally stuck? If it's not helping you start, if it's not helping you start removing it, from your life immediately um, start replacing it with things that are moving you towards your goals of greatness that's why it's important to feed yourself positive things to listen to and to watch um, surround yourself with um, people that have positive um, minds and people who are motivational and inspiring um, a big favorite of mine is comedy. Um, I always recommend that to uh, friends and family. Um, <clears throat> and a lot of people say, well, how do I do that if I don't know any people like that? YouTube. YouTube. YouTube is free. YouTube is my favorite place to go to listen to motivational speakers, inspirational people, um, YouTube and it's free. I love it. That's why I'm here. <laughs> Speaking is a big part of your life. And this should have came before the part before this. But speaking is a big part of our life food as well. Um, we need to take time to think about the words that we use as well because the old saying goes Oops. the power of life and death is in the tongue so we're also influenced by our thought mindful of everything that you are feeding yourself as far as life food continue to stay blessed feel free to share this with um, some friends and family 
subscribe, hit the like button if this was helpful to you. Thanks for watching. See you soon.